What's up, you guys? It's your girl Sharon Shamika, and I'm back with another freaking video. Yeah, I've been gone for a little minute. Always, I always pop in and pop out and say I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do that, and I'm still not on top of what I got going on. So yeah, you wondering? Okay, the girl look cute. She got makeup done. Ah, 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 ah. I had a photo shoot today, and it was successful. Even though you know I kind of lurked with doing certain stuff, but yeah. Anyways, I got it down for my business. I had a photo shoot for my business, and and I've been gone, so I'm going to do a Q and A. I look cute on. Oh, yeah, and I just went to Miami, came back, and y'all look. Your girl got. I got my ears pierced, and it hurts so bad. Now, we did, like back in the days, y'all, I did. Well, my mom got our first piercings, of course, but then we did. Me and my sister, we did the second ones on our own. But then some told me, ooh, I always used to watch my best friends. You know, like she got so many hoes everywhere. So I was like, ooh, I want those. So let me go to Miami and do something crazy. Yeah, I think this is crazy. Cause yeah, it hurts very, very much. But anyways, we're going to get to the um, Q and A. Because this is what this is today. A Q and A. Normally people go to Instagram, they, they follow us, ask they follow us, um, question, Q&A um, for their video. I have done that several times. I don't have a YouTube family, I guess, on my channel. I mean, not my channel. I don't have a YouTube family on my Instagram. So, they ain't messing with it. I don't know what it is. I don't know. But anyways, let's get straight into it. Um... If you know, you know. The first one started off with Crush. Why? Like, my husband, duh. But if I must say, <laughs> if we talk about celebrities, Omar Epps. My middle name is Shamika. My shoe size, I'm not telling y'all. Okay, I got a story. My shoe size back in the days was a size five. And I always try to squeeze my little foot, my big foot, in a size five, y'all. I'm true to size now, cause I have got <laughs> my foot is big now. I was size nine. <laughs> um, eye color is supposed to be a dark brown. Um, last time you cried, I cry all the time. I'm very sensitive. I stay crying. Players, you know, get a little sensitive. <laughs> um, my biggest fear, going up to heaven and getting kicked out of heaven. That's my biggest fear. Not making it into heaven. We're going to leave it at that. If you know, then you know. Um, last person you text. Um... My best friend, my bestie was the last person I tested. Show me. No, yeah, she was the last person I tested. Um, let's see, relationship status. I am married. I'm married. Um, I don't have a favorite sports team. I don't really, you know, I'm not into sports like that. I jump off the, uh, I'm from the A, y'all, so I jump off the wagon every now and then. I jump on when they win, I jump off when they lose them. 
uh, favorite color. I think I said this on one of my videos, but I will mention it one more time. Not mention it, I will say it one more time. My favorite color is red. Red everything. Red everything. Just because I don't have on red right now, I still love red. Uh, favorite celebrity. Uh, I don't have one. I got a crush. But I don't have a favorite celebrity. I, don't, I just don't. Um, any scars? Yeah, I have a scar, but you can't see it. I had a baby. My last, I have several babies, but my last baby I got cut. And that's the scar I would never forget because if it went for her, I would be still having babies right today. <laughs> um, kissed anyone? Duh, my husband, my kids, of course. Someone you hate. I don't hate anyone. I love everybody. Even my enemies. <laughs> Ever done drugs? Sure did. I sure did. Every time they take me to the hospital, I be ready for them drugs. Give me the drugs. All the drugs. Every time I got pregnant, give me the drugs. Yeah, but now, I did five of my pregnancies. Five of my pregnancies natural. And one, well, no, my first one wasn't natural. I had to have an epidural. All the rest of them natural up until my last one. I had to have a cesarean. And boo boo, they gave me the drugs. That drugs. Mm -hmm. If you know, then you know. Hmm. Um. Height, I am 5'5. Five, 5'5. Five. Five, five. Do you drink? Yeah. Last thing you bought. Mm. The last thing I bought was, I believe these earrings, y'all. They're cute. Yeah, I bought these. The last, that's the last thing I bought was the earrings. Uh, day or night. Day or night. Oh. Day. Because I ain't night no more, y'all. I go to sleep. <laughs> the older you get, you know. I go to sleep. Um. Do you give second chance? situation it depends on the situation mm -mm. details details I do but it depends on the situation because no it depends on how, how 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 bad it was like how bad it really really was mm. Mm. Last book I read, the Bible. I read books. <laughs> um, birthday. My birthday is August twenty fourth. So any times you, any time August come around, and yes, don't say Leo. It's a Virgo, baby. August twenty fourth. Any time August come around, y'all shout me out. Sharon Shamika, Virgo, baby. Been ghetto right now. It's okay. Uh, favorite song? My favorite song? I have a lot of favorite songs. It depends on... That was my Bible. Um, gospel. We're going gospel. My favorite song for gospel. It gonna be all right. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Ty tripping. Um, if we go on for rap, 
I-N-D-E-P-E-N. Yeah, I'm stuck on this song. I'm always be stuck on this song. I ain't going nowhere. Boost, boost. Um, I used to listen to that song all the time. It's the one my baby didn't come out my stomach singing that song because I used to listen to it all the time. Time, all the time. Um, R&B would be... Let me... If you know, then you know. <laughs> um... Do you believe in love? Of course, I'm in love. I love my husband. Um, someone I trust. God. God is the only man I trust. Um. Ooh, ooh. Are you okay? Mentally, sometimes, physically, sometimes, it can get very overwhelming, life, um, so, yeah, sometimes, I'm okay, um, let's get deep, deep, deep. What's the one thing you cannot live without? My kids. They get on my nerves so bad. But my kids. I don't know. I just don't know. I guess when you have kids of your own, you just feel so loved. And just don't. Like, they push me. They really do push me. Of course, you go through your ups and downs and stuff. But at the end of the day, your kids going to give you 100% unconditional love. So, my kids. I can't live without them. Mm. All these words are my kids. I mean, all these questions. What makes you most angry about our country? <laughs> yeah, please stop trying to fight. I'm so sick of dealing with these missiles everywhere. Why? Why? Why y'all keep trying to fight? Leave it alone. That's the only thing. Like, them keep trying to fight. Like, ain't nobody got time for that. Like, stop. Um. How, how do you recharge? Pray. That's how I recharge. Rest and pray. And that's real talk. For real, for real. For me, I feel like a different person every time. And my kids are gone. <laughs> my kids are gone. I recharge. Duh. Uh, just gone to their parents. I mean, their grandparents, of course. But I still love them. Oh, what impression do you think you give when you first meet someone? <laughs> Y'all. Oh, she stuck up. Sometimes bougie. I don't even look like a bougie, but that's what I have been told. Um, but, but really I'm not, none of those things. I just like to observe. I guess that's me. I mean, I'm a fun person to be around, but that's just what I do. I observe. But if we want to do that, I mean, say it that way, that's what they say. I'm stuck up. I need to loosen up. Uh, I'm mean. Why did I say that first? I'm mean. They say that too. 
Um, yeah, I don't get no really no good. Oh, she's she's cool. She seems like she's friendly. Blah 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 blah. I read you quick, fast, and hurry. Hmm. I know a person. When I see a person, I know a person. Fake. Um. Would you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? I think that's how you see it. <clears throat> At first, I would say an introvert. I would say an introvert. But then, yeah, of course, you know, one, two, a little some, some. Um, <laughs> let me stop. Um, then when I open up to you, and get to know you and you know you're around more often then I'm a extrovert but right you know I'm not shy you know I just observe that's the difference y'all gotta look at me really really good pay attention to me because when if I'm silent that don't mean I'm shy no I'm just paying attention to you I'm trying to figure you out and when I figure you out then I can know where to place you when I figure you out I don't like too many people either I just plan. What's something that offends you? Um, when people say, "Are you pregnant?" <laughs> I'm gonna be real with you. When people say, "Are you pregnant?" And and especially when I just told them how many kids I have, "Are you pregnant?" I guess they so used to seeing me with a small stomach, but. <laughs> no, no, I'm not in my legs, in my ankles. Oh. Mm. What do you want your final words to be? Well done. Well done. Um. Which is more important, what you say or how you say it? It's not what you say, it's how you say it. My mom tells us that all the time. It's not what you say, it's how you say it. And we like to talk with our, it's not talk. But anyways, it's what you say to me. Because if, mm, we're gonna get into that later, but it's not what you say, it's how you say it. Now you can say something all day, blah, 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 blah. okay, cool, but it's how you say it. Like, it's how you say it, because they're gonna get you knocked up. I'm just like, I'm just like, sorry, sorry. But yeah, it is how you say it. Not what you say, how you say it. But. So, I'm going to do a part two right now. I'm still warming up to it. I'm not used to doing Q&As, um, but I guess I just looked up something on YouTube and kind of seen, you know, where to go, what direction to go, where I wanted to go, what I wanted. I was tired of doing mukbangs all the time. Mukbangs, mukbangs. I'm still coming back with them, but not so like every video. And then, of course, I said something about my business. I'm going to start doing business. I don't did so many, like, hairstyles on people. And I ain't even been posting it or nothing, y'all. It just, I got to be able to just get up and say, look, let me put this, you know, put this, set this camera up and record it. But, until then, y'all, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to get better. It's just right now. I'm still trying to open up and trying to figure this YouTube out. Yes, I've been on YouTube. Well, I actually started, I think, like two, three years ago when I actually started. But I'm still, like, not picking up like that because I guess I'm not 100% 100% in it yet. But And then I'm still talking to the camera. So I got to get used to all that. Um... Yeah, but I do have like two, three other channels also. Um, you can follow me on those as well. Subscribe um, to 
double trouble queens that's me and my sister's channel we're still slowly coming back because she just had a baby um it's been spa family that's my family channel you you blah, 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 blah. you will be seeing more of me and my family on that channel um i also have a couple's channel i don't post as much on there because my husband tried drugs so we'll start that back up sooner or later um and my kids my two little girls they have a channel as well um renea and rihanna show i have so much going on yeah i just gotta get into one channel and just boom i be doing too much but anyways like this video comment subscribe hit the notification bell every time i drop a video i'm trying i'll say i am i'm gonna say i'm gonna try to drop more videos for you guys and it won't be boring hopefully <laughs> but anyways y'all i'm signing out peace